Hey guys and welcome to episode number 7 of The Journeyman and possibly our last episode in Colombia. As you know if you've seen the other episodes we have been outstanding in campaign 1.5 and we've made it all the way to the playoff final which you will see today. It's two legged just like the rest of them and they could be our last games at America de Cali. It's a club where we've battled strongly, we've made friends that will live a lifetime but you know, if you want to be the best, you've got to circle the bloody planet. But we're going to jump straight in to the first leg of the final. We're sponsored by Pepsi. They're sponsored by Huawei. And their kits, I mean, it's red and white all the way through, isn't it? We're going to go in the home kit. We're at home. As you can see, we're a little bit tired. <sighs> Feeling nervous. Feeling that A lot of people, I say a lot of people, about 12 people have probably watched all my videos. Less than that. We'll know I'm a big time bottle job. We bottled so many games in the Barcelona series. We haven't really had a chance to bottle it this series. But we've been pretty rubbish for the first half of the season. But this second half we've pushed on. We've beat our biggest rivals, the best team in Colombia in the quarters and the final. Now we're here against Santa Fe who finished I believe third in the normal season. So they did finish above us. Oh my god am I tense. There we are, ahead of the playoff final, looking nervous. There's the lineup. You know him by now, the stars of the team. Aristeguito, who's been absolutely clutch throughout this. Riascos on the wing, Dan the man in midfield with us. Alvarez, who's the top scorer in the whole league for the second half of the season. Kadavid, who's been absolute dynamite in goal. You know the boys, you know them well enough. Let's get in to the first leg of the playoff final. Santa Fe coming forward for the first time in the game. They've passed it around us nicely. It's a good through ball, Kadavid. Oh. They play it around nicely and it's Kadavid again. Go on, Viveros. Why has he started running inside there? Look at the little movement he makes. So I'm going to replay it for the first time ever. Why would he, in any state of mind, think that's the right thing to do in that situation? It's Valencia, that wide rower. Perez back to Roa, it's lovely football and it's a fantastic effort at goal from Roa and it's trickled wide, I think it might have brushed the posters on its way but it was very unlucky. We have not turned up at all personally so far, we have been absolutely shambolic. It's a good interception, it's got the fans banging on the terraces. Oh my god! Riascos has let it go through his legs. Alvarez! Oh, he's at the post! Oh, it was lovely football. I'll go back over that way to Segovia. He's gone inside to Alvarez. Riascos. That's a lovely ball. Aristeguita! Every time I knock this over. He's done it again! The man for all seasons. The playoff boy. I wasn't involved at all. Joyce feels bloody great when I'm trying to prove that I deserve a transfer. What a ball by Alvarez, Aristeguita got in front of his man and they don't get much more in the corner than that folks, it's 1-0, he's come up bloody trumps, so I think it's important we keep the clean sheet from this point on, unless the chance to score another comes up, we are on the break here, it's Viveros, you got options son, good ball, good ball, left footed cross, it's in front of Aristeguita, oh, oh, it's down the man, He's whipped it in Aris Degueto again and it's well saved by the keeper. Palaza, they're playing it around nicely. Kadavid, well played son. And surely that's it. A big first leg win is in the bag lads. 1-0 in the first leg of the playoff final. No away goals for Santa Fe. We had a shocker but the boys as so often this season got it over the line for us. It's a big, big win. So just a few days later as you can see we're going straight into the second leg. It's the away leg. We are starting again. We're in the away kit of Santa Fe. No, they have got quite the mountain to climb here. We know we need to be switched on. You can see the terraces are packed out. Not an empty seat in sight. Paz finds me. I mean, do you remember we scored those long shots in episode four? I bet you boys were like, wow, Jack's going to start scoring a lot of goals. Nope, we still can't shoot. To Guichon. Perlaza, it's a good through ball, deal with it, deal with it, I thought that was in, I really thought that was in, 
I could see the run early out here. Oh, they didn't use it. Perez. You can't have a go at me for that. Oh, no. Santa Fe have scored. It's the number 10. God knows what his name is. Omar Perez with his fifth of the season. And suddenly, time resets and it's nil-nil. It's played out wide. Medina, can he get it in? It's a good ball. He's got space. Oh. And they're now going down the line soon after. They whipped it back post early. It's nodded back across. No. Oh, I was so sure that was in. Aristeguita. It's my moment. Yes. Get in. It's me. I've done. How dark is this? Jesus Christ. Let's get a light on people. That's made no difference. We scored! <laughs> Aris de Guita, it was our good pressing. This first touch really scared me, but we managed to smash it off the post and in. We've done it again. The biggest stage, our fourth goal of the season. That's a big goal. I think they now need three. I think away goals are in effect. As you can see, we're into injury time in the first half. What a time to score, and we got the bloody goal. In my last series, I slated all these YouTubers and said, look, you know they're going to win anyway, but I'm not that sort of player. But we are winning, and we've scored the winner. It's like it's scripted, but I swear to God it isn't. Because if it was scripted, I would have changed so much other stuff. I'll go short, chip it up, swing it in. Oh, my goodness, that could have been the game right there. I'm coming for you again. We might try the exact same thing, the old chip up and cross. Psych, psych. We've whipped it in. Alvarez! That has got to be it, people. Surely that is enough to make sure we have won campaign 1.5. We were a bloody goal down this game. And me, 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 scored the goal and then this. Merc the defender, whip it in. He's just come off the bench. And it's a fantastic header. 2-1. We're, we're bloody doing it, people. We are bloody doing it. Getting a bit carried away with the attacking play. That's a fantastic flick on from that dude. Rowers out wide. He's whipped it in. Segovia, of course. Who else? Oh, no. Oh, dear, oh, dear. He's got his second of the game. Omar Perez is having quite the show. Surely, surely, surely. Segovia wins a header to end the game. But the referee is blown up. We've done it. I pressed X, didn't I? I forgot to even see if we lifted a bloody trophy. But we've done it, people. We have won. The Liga Dimior 1.5. Who bloody expected that? And as you can see, here's our goal. We'll watch it one more time. Is that touch? But boom, posting in. We've bloody done it. I can't believe it. We have won the Colombian division. From 18th last season to getting into the playoffs this time and beating the best club in the country and our arch rivals on the way. And then winning the final like that. As you can see, our stats have taken a hefty increase from that. We're, we're almost at 74 now. And let's see if any offers come in. Is anyone going to come in for the Pepsi Max Playmaker before deadline day? A transfer offer has come in. Who is it? But we start in the south of Mexico. Where Jack Stephen has been speaking to Jim White this afternoon in an exclusive interview addressing the transfer from America de Cali to one of the biggest clubs in Mexico. Let's cross live now to the Pyrenees. Jim, what was that Stevens. mood like this afternoon? And what was the key message that he wanted to get across? Well, Tony, good evening to you. It really has been quite a momentous day here in Mexican land. This was Jack Stevens as we've never heard him before, as we've never seen him before. And you might think that the transfer to Tigres has changed him, but no, he is still humble, gorgeous and talented and cannot wait to get started with Tigres. Rawr. That is right, boys. You heard Jim White correctly. The Pepsi Max playmaker, Jack Stevens, is taking his talents slightly north to Mexico as we join Tigres. As you can see, we look absolutely beautiful in the kit. Can't wait to get started. Season 2 of The Journeyman will start 
on Monday in Tigres, as you can see, and we'll give you a whole breakdown of the club, their history, bloody everything. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like, hit the bell notification so you find out exactly when Season 2 starts, and thank you so much for watching. Come on, the boys.